so today I will be upgrading from 8 gigabytes to 16 in this new uh, kit that I bought these are 16 and it's just crucial uh, it's meant to be x8 memory and not x16 that is being shipped with uh, the computers so x8 is faster than x16 I will link this in the description below as well as the tool that I will be using today to disassemble this it is very simple we just remove all the screws that keep the back panel on. Once all the screws have been removed, the easiest way to get underneath the cover is to simply use a pen cap. You start from the part that has the grills, and then you sort of go underneath like so. I have opened my laptop a great number of times, so it is actually quite easy for me to simply remove the back cover. For this procedure, I would recommend actually removing the battery connector here. It gets easier when you have one of these, or even two, or just nails if you have them. The battery connector is always very easy to remove, but you don't need to put it out all the way. Even if you put it a bit back, it should be fine. The memory slots are of course here, and it is indeed very easy to remove them. All you have to do is remove this to the side push them to the side here and here and then remove the memory there we go same here and there here and here it's quite simple all you have to do is put them in like so making sure there is no extraneous body. Make sure that you push them in enough so that the pins are no longer visible and simply push down. It will feel a bit hard but that's okay. Simply push down and the new memory bits are in place. You won't be able to make a mistake where you turn them around because of the pin that is right here. Not sure if you can see it. There is a pin right here that will prevent you from uh, putting them in the wrong direction. And of course, don't forget to put the battery connector back. Just for your curiosity, the memory I was using before is indeed X16. You can read it here. And it is just 8 gigs of, 8 gigs of DDR4 RAM. 3200 as usual. 